welcome back to the Chuckus Ruckus Clone Trike build series. It's got to, it had to have been like two and a half months or three months since my last video. It's taken a long time to get everything ready. Uh, not to mention I've kind of been working on the Grom Clone if you've seen that series. If you haven't seen it, make sure you check that out. So this is what I got working with. I've got the uh, powder coated frame back. I kind of assembled the, uh, the axle already. So taking the wheels over to my buddy Greg, who does all my wheels, because we're going to get these tires off here. And uh, that way we can clear coat, paint, make these wheels glossy as can be. A lot better than, it's, uh, than it is on powder coat. Let's do it. So I got the wheels back from Greg. I just have to do some sanding, things like that. I, I got the wheels laid out here. Just kind of need to rough it up, rough up all this uh, this old paint and make sure it's really clean. Getting ready to wash my hands in the sink. This. Freaking little critter. Good thing I don't mind mice. Jeez. I'm surprised he didn't go through this tube. This is like our drain. That's where he was inside the tube there. We'll get you out of there. I've actually got him right here. I'm gonna release him into the wild. Here he is. I'm here at my parents' house because my house has HOAs. My shop doesn't allow painting. Perfect place. I painted in this garage when I was a kid. Tons. Cars and things. So I got these, these wheels just kind of sitting right here on bailing wire. And uh, I kind of prepped them at the shop already. So I'm just going to put some, some uh, grease and uh, wax remover on there. Get the paint mixed up. And paint it up. Primer's done. Check it. dark so I'm not gonna do the clear today and I want to like put these these out in the light make sure they look really good I didn't miss anything before uh, I do the clear So here is our uh, QMB 139 motor, also known as a GY650. If you, if you ever wanted to know how to identify your motor, right here in front of the kickstart, it's stamped. This boat motor is actually in a lot of different things. It's in the Tau Tau's, the Raketa's, the Wolf Scooters, Pumas. Uh, geez, there's like so, Sunny Scooters. There's so many Chinese scooters that basically if you have a 50cc Chinese scooter, this is the motor you have in it. And in this motor we have the 120 cc big bore kit. It's actually had like a 95 cc. It just depends who you ask. It's 52 millimeter to get be specific. It's got the stroker crank. 
This, this motor is completely built. The problem is the top speed just sucks. Um, so, you know, we're going to install these taller gears. These are the 18 front, 46 rear uh, gears. And this is, that's the max you can go, at least the max that I could come up with um, for gearing. So this should increase our top speed. This is step one, and then we'll start putting this motor back in. That's really all it needs. This motor is a little bit different because it's got the sprocket on the back, unlike a scooter has got the sh little shaft for the wheel. So get that going and uh, get ready to put this motor back in. The motor has to go in this lower kind of like swing arm frame. So my wife behind the cam is going to help me. I'll lift the motor in, she'll slide the bolts in. Before I put the rest of the frame on, we got to put the blue chain on. But I got to put it on there and uh, like mark it because this chain's way too long. Got to make sure that the, uh, there we go, all the way forward. There we go. All right, I got it. I got the pin. It's gonna mark that. So I got her marked. Where is that mark? Right here. So that's the pin that I need to remove. So I'm just gonna grind off this uh, tab. Okay. Just need to get the slack out of the chain by tightening these back here. Yeah. I don't know if you can see those, but they're down here. And then I could tighten down all these bolts. But we wanted just a little bit of slack, probably something like that. So I'll get these tightened. Dudes. 
Check these out. Huh? Same one as in the Grom build series. This is way better than this, the other one. So, out with the old, in with the new. Might have to adjust the height on them. I could totally do that. But we want this thing to look lowered. It's looking good right there. Dudes, look at those. Those are about as slick as it comes in that little block there. I had to move it from back here because it's not gonna, like the, the line isn't long enough. So we'll remount it. Ran the uh, brake line up. Oh yeah. You ready for these? These are the wheels I painted, super excited. Bam! Glossy black going on the rear. We got rid of the flat tires. We're doing rounded. I think it'll look a lot better. It'll also handle way better. So uh, let me put those on. Dudes, what? That's way too sweet. Look at that. Dang. Killer.